further. I wouldn't want to be hitting a golf ball in this. Last year at Carnoustie, it was um, 50 mile an hour winds. This is a light zephyr. And you've been having a good time in the light zephyr, haven't you? I have, yeah. Well, it's been a bit of a musician's union. Me and uh, Ronan Keating and Dave Farrell. Well, actually, a whole boy band was being formed. We were actually talking about whether we could write a song specifically for the Dunhill. Do you want to get that prepared for next year? Think about some memories of the Dunhill. You've been playing yeah. a good few years now. How yeah. many years has it been for this you? This is my fifth year. Everything about it fills my heart with joy. I actually love the music that we do on the Saturday night. Golf throws together musicians from very different backgrounds. You've got Huey, you've got Tico from Bon Jovi, Dave Farrell from Lincoln Park, Ronan, and yet we all sort of come together on a Saturday night and try and make it work. And there's something really special about that, and I always love it. What is the right attitude for you to have a good round here? I'm playing with Jordan Smith this year, who I've not met yet, but I hear he's tee to green, he's one of the best players on the European tour, so I'm very you excited You could be the winners. <laughs> you never know. Let's not get ahead of ourselves. I start thinking about the first tee shot in about sort of May or June. I'm just focusing on that, and then whatever happens, happens. I think you've got to try and play with freedom, though, right? You've got to just play as though it doesn't really matter. You're talking like a true pro now. Yeah. What other tips okay. have you picked up over the years? Last year, I got to play a practice round with Padre Carrington, and he's got amazing advice. But the problem was I was playing so badly that I couldn't do anything sensible. Um, OK, so but... not that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, this is what not to do. Yeah. And how did golf even come into your life? Well, my grandfather was absolutely obsessed with the game. He ran a school. He turned the grounds into a nine-hole golf course. So I grew up just knocking golf balls around that. Super and I casually. Loved it. What yeah. is one of your great memories of playing here at the Dunhill? So I think to complete the set <laughs> of hitting it out of bounds on, on one and 18 in the same round is the greatest achievement. Actually incredibly have. satisfying. Absolutely. I actually hit the Rusak sign. <laughs> Did you? <laughs> yes. That's why they had to do a refurb. Yes, probably. <laughs> Thank you so much for that. I really enjoyed it. Thank you. <laughs>